It is in January that we have the report and the findings of the report with many, many good recommendations. To be honest, uh, we don't have the expertise and we don't have the capacity. And of course, we don't have the financial resources. However, one of the things that we are in the process of doing in the coming week, we will identify the implementation committee that will work closely with the cultural department to work towards the implementation of the various recommendations. That is very important that it's done by a group of professionals. What we are looking at, I'm going to be open about it, I've discovered last month that starting next year, there's going to be structurally $170 million available in the kingdom for culture and heritage. And I think City Stations have has an opportunity there to be able to tap into these resources, but we need a team of people that will work along with our cultural department, not only our cultural department, but all the stakeholders in the cultural domain. So I refer to the City Stations Historical Foundation. There is a group that recently started called the African Slave Burial Ground um, Alliance. They have reached out to us and we will closely be working with them and also find a place for them also in the implementation committee. So one of the main points that is recommended is to find a suitable location uh, to do the internment, but also re-internment, but also to look at a memorial. So you need a group of people who will work together. We need to have people with strong penmanship who will know how to write projects because when you're submitting for, for monies, you got to know what you're putting on paper so that when it reaches its destination, you don't waste time and you can get the resources that you need. So in the scope of everything, we have said it over and over, as our island uh, develops, because of its historical nature, almost every area of this island is sensitive. We know that. We've known it for years, but as we go into improving the infrastructure of the island, we don't want to make any mistakes. We see, for instance, we will have the Golden Rock Resort Road built between slave walls. We need nowhere else in the Caribbean, to my knowledge. Even the Bay Road, when we do that later this year, there will be um, sensitive areas that we have to take into consideration. But tonight is meant to show our community that with all the stakeholders, that everything is being done possible to involve the community, engage the community and the stakeholders to ensure that we make the right steps and the right decisions.